What is up guys, Jake with Casually Commerce, and in this video I'm going to show you a quick tip that's going to help you out with fulfilling orders when you're using the Oberlo app. And sometimes when you place a lot of orders, a lot of individual orders, not only can that be a red flag to your credit card provider and they might freeze your credit card, but also this also raises the likelihood that AliExpress is going to flag you and you're going to have to um, sometimes re-verify your account. So with that said, I'm going to show you a quick tip that's going to make everything a lot easier and it's also going to make the bookkeeping process a lot easier as well. So let's go ahead and dive right into my computer and get right into it. Okay guys, so we're inside Oberlo and I've already went ahead and created a test order um, inside of a sample store and I'm going to go ahead and show you how you can fulfill this in a different way so that way you'll be less likely to get flagged by AliExpress and your credit card company. So what you're going to do is once you're in here fulfilling the orders and uh, just a quick disclaimer, uh, if you have a VA doing your orders, you can also have them um, do this as well. It's pretty easy. So all you're going to do is go ahead and order. And then we'll just sit here and let this go through. And I'll go ahead and put in a phone number because I don't have an override uh, phone number on this sample account. And then what you're going to want to do here is come down here to show all payment methods and then go ahead and select other payment methods. So you're going to select other payment methods and then just hit confirm. And then you're going to show up to uh, this screen right here. And obviously I'm going to block out um, my information here. So you're, you're going to see a big white block. However, um, once you're here, that's it. All you have to do is just exit out. And then um, you just you can come over here and flag the order, have your VA flag the order or whatever. So that way you know you already ordered it. But what we're going to do now is go back to AliExpress and then I'm going to show you what to do. So let's say um, you had like 20 orders. So you're going to do that for 20 orders and then you're just going to go to my orders and then you're going to see right here that we have orders that say awaiting payment. So then all you really have to do is go ahead and click on this. So if you had 20 orders that you fulfilled in that manner, then you just go ahead and click this and then they'll all show up and then you see right here you can uh, select pay for all orders. So then it's gonna go ahead and sync the entire order amount and then you can go ahead and come over here and then we can pay for all of the orders at once, which is pretty cool. So uh, like I said, the advantages of doing this is you're gonna be a lot less likely to get flagged by AliExpress. You're gonna be a lot less likely to get flagged by your credit card company. And it's a lot easier for bookkeeping to see uh, like one expense on there that's like maybe 40 orders for $500 versus uh, 40 separate or individual orders which is a lot more annoying to go ahead and keep track of so like I said just a quick tip for order fulfillment however it is very um, helpful especially because you can uh, it also makes the order fulfillment process for the VA a lot easier because uh, they don't have to confirm anything with your credit card or anything because sometimes even with your credit card saved in Alipay, you still have to confirm the number. So doing it this way, you don't have to give your VA any um, credit card information. They just need your AliExpress login and they just click other payment methods like we went over and then exit out. So you don't have to give out your credit card information to anyone with this method as well. So that's another plus. So if you like quick tips like this, go ahead, give the video a thumbs up, subscribe to the, vid to the channel for more content, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you guys in another video.